One of the other things I want to talk about with vases is that process of making them the first step that they would do. And we see the indication of this tool all over the place. They would take that lump of stone and they would use a core drill, a tube drill. They would drill out the center of that vase first, right? You take the bit of stone, you drill out the center of it, and then you can start shaping the outside. You can start machining out the inside, polishing out the marks. And on lots of vases, we find this mark. So these things, tubular drills, were absolutely used in their construction as one of the first steps. And these are quite powerful tools. You don't just see them in vases, we also find them all over the stonework uh, on ancient sites, particularly in the Old Kingdom. What I think the quarriers were looking for is they were looking for these tubular drill holes because it's, it's, think of it as like a weakness in that stone. So they would, they would find a drill hole, they'd go to the back of the block, they'd hammer in their little wedges, they'd you know, dig in little trenches, wedges, and then they'd split the stone. They'd split the stone on the axis of that tube drill and so what you're left with is kind of this open tube drill.